Well, hello, my beautiful people. I want to start out. I want to start the stream with prayer. I want to pray with everybody. Everything that I state is, you know, for me and you. So if you see me, it's R. You know what I mean. But I hope everybody's having a, a good Thursday. A little under the weather, getting a little bit better. So that's great. Uh, I come to you, Lord, Father God. The peace that comes through faith in you surpasses all human understanding. Help us to keep our faith in you alone, that we would have peace and not falter in our thinking. The world wants to destroy the peace I have through faith in you. Protect our mind and our hearts from the things of this world. There's things out in the world that's going to seek, destroy, and kill. Try to anyways. But with the faith of God, we got to stay strong, stay together, and show us everything that we learned through the faith of Jesus Christ. There's only one book. There's only one way. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless everybody. Well, what's up, uh, Papa Julo? Kepa so Kinsey. Thank you for jumping, jumping, uh, jumping in and stopping by, my bro. Just doing a little bit of stream, a little bit of prayer, spread the gospel through, through, through the tube, you know. Uh, you know, just, just, just trying to make it different. That's all we're trying to do. But we'll be starting soon. Cold Space Sheriff's Off. We'll see you in a minute. So stick tight. Stick around. We'll see you in a minute. Yeah. Love you, buddy. Thank you for stopping by. I'm doing great, man. How are you, man? I'm blessed. I'm blessed, blessed, blessed. Hope you're, hope you are as well, and hope you and the family's doing well, man. Thank you for stopping by and showing us love. I'm gonna try to get out here and stick it a little bit, you know, <laughs> like we always do. How's the sound? Sound good, man? The voice sounds good, not cracking or popping, not that, uh, Kins. Hopefully. Hopefully not. Well, hey, everybody. What's up, guys? Welcome to the stream. Thursday afternoon, guys. Hope all is well. Sorry I'm a little under the weather, um, but getting a little bit better. Um, doing my thing out here. So he's like, you know what? Let's get in here and 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 kick it with the Sheriff David O and Beth a little bit. So, guys, of, of course, as you guys see, um, I changed some stuff around a little bit. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Uh, Perez. Appreciate you, my bro. Appreciate you, Cap. Um, so, as you guys see in the map, I said I was going to keep the other repair shops. But, you know, shout out to uh, Major 5 PD, man. He's a creator. Reached out to him. Very quick response. On I fell in love with this immersive mechanic. So, it's pretty cool. It does go by the the damage of the vehicle. If there's no damage, it just comes and does a quick tune up. Now, the more extensive damage you have, I hardly not, I hardly try not to wreck my unit and stuff like that. So I try to keep it to top shape. But you know, here in the near future, with you see these, and I'll show you in the map here shortly. That the more damage you have, the longer the mechanic takes. So what we're going to do is we're going to drive down there, and I put them all in the in the in the shops. There's a couple of shops that I didn't put them in. That I don't never ever go to, but I mean, yeah. Uh, um, uh, so, like I said, if it needs to be, and eventually soon, I'm gonna add them to the the SOs and the PDs that have garages. But now they, I, we don't have them now because I want to display them to where we got them coded uh, in the config as well. So as I press start on the keyboard or my sorry controller, and these are the new indicators. And when you go to these shops. Uh, there's some that's different when you go down to the city and you go into the one that's um, the main mechanic downtown where everybody goes to in GT Online. You have to go all the way, drive all the way in, and turn into that little other cubby hole that's almost by the back of the shop, and then walk by that door uh, and then press E. 
I won't be displaying that, but eventually you guys get the hang of it. And then the ones in the in the one shop downtown over here, uh, where's it at? Uh, Benny's. You have to drive all the way in, park your car next to the cars that's all the way in the in there in the shop, and then you have to walk by the toolbox and press E. But I won't be displaying that. But eventually, eventually everybody would get to get the hang of it. So the only ones that I did not put back in and I. I don't never go to, but if we have some city role players, say, hey, man, how come this garage doesn't have it? And uh, can we put it in? I don't mind to get in there and add it in there. So I think there's one more. Uh, there's a there's a mod shop. Around. I took a picture with the, because once you move it, it takes the marker off the map. Anyways, so uh, we got a couple of them in there, but we do have a handful of them that in the vanilla one. So the one in Costa Lido is there, so you'll see the, the blue and uh, blue, uh, well, black object with the blue uh, lining around them. Then we have <clears throat> this one here in Coastal Shores right there. And then we have the one that's right here, the vanilla ones. They was already there. I just added a couple more. So this is the one, the Emlo's mechanic shop that I have that I added in. So it has that there as well. And I said once I figure out, and shout out to Major 5 PD, uh, guided me to the exact thing to do so we got one right there i think that one was vanilla as well so the vanilla repair shops that was it was already coded already in there in the in the config i just added to the ones to the coastal shores the emlos that we have that we've added and then to, uh, i think uh, coastal Lido was already implemented so that one and then uh that one and i don't think there's any more that i just that's not non-vanilla is what we added but there's a couple more uh repair shops down in the city where the gate the big door opens uh, it's a it's a it's a repair shop down there so uh we'll, we'll show you we're gonna go ahead and take the uh, take the um the the durango down and um and show you what i'm talking about but it's cool. It's just I'm a very big fan of like if you interaction like and I know if it's just AI. So right now we're gonna be we're gonna be on ten six right now. Well we got the door open so if she has any print holds. So we're gonna go ahead and take the Durango down and get it a quick old change. It happens so quick when the vehicle doesn't have damage. So, but I just like it wherever you're it'll fade in, fade out, you'll see the mechanic, he'll walk towards the vehicle and after you get in there and press Ian Hong and he fixes it. It's just more I'm really big fan of the ped mastery thing, but this immersive, you actually see a mechanic come down. Jeremiah, Jeremiah I'll see you in a little bit, man. Thank you so much for coming in the day off. I appreciate you. Oh, yeah, man. you got to keep the shop clean, man. Shop shop clean in reference of the unit and, and the mechanic shops. And uh, I sort of didn't like the big thing hovering over, like when you drive in and you've seen the car um, and the thing sitting there. Only thing I want to see is the 5 PD ring that we go drop them off at 1015. But um, we got in there and uh, added some stuff. And now there's all those shops that I just advised in the on the map is that immersive mechanic. So I'll show you what I'm talking about once we get down there. But I like that a lot. You can actually have a pet walk up, fix your car. So right now we're going to be 10 6. We're going to go down and say we need an oil change. It's going to be a quick oil change because we're fixed up, gassed up. And I don't think it's going to mess up the the gas. Uh, settings we got a full tank if we, if we do we'll just go ahead and see that's why you gotta look both ways these AIs just don't care they'll run you over run you over so on right, let's come over here and if the gas station blows up 1022 that so I wish all the AIs drove a little bit like me you know that'd be a, a better world had some more uh, human physics built into the AI so turn signals you come to an intersection stop look both ways not really look both ways but you know do AI generated but anyway, so for we'll come here, we got the unit, and uh, we got some people hanging out here at the, the thing. So we, now we come in here, and people will get confused because they don't know the sweet spot. But eventually, if I get all the Leos in here, uh, we have a thing getting together. I'll show everybody. So we're pulling the car, and go here. And a uh, shout out to Major uh, Five PD as well. So remember, I used to go in. And I used to have to write the coordinates down, right? Uh, well, coordinates whenever I go uh, uh, miscellaneous de de developer tools show coordinates, right? That's. Hold on, guys. I got 21. Hold on one second. Be back.
Guys, I'm on a 21, mobile 21. I'll be back here shortly, guys. Sorry for the inconvenience. Okay, guys, sorry, we're back. Um, I was on a mobile 21, important mobile 21. So as you guys see, we bring the shop down here to get it, uh, of course, get an oil change. And we'll come to this spot right here, especially if you're in the Coastal Shores area, is configured. Oh, well, let me show you what's, what's, what's so cool about it. You know how I had to go into the miscellaneous setting, show developer to coordinates. Now it's amazing. This uh, major 5PD hooked us, hook, uh, this, us up really, really well. Not really, because it's a free resource. I just never knew about it, but it is awesome. So now, when we're if I'm in here messing around the server, I just do this slash chords, and it, it copies it to the clipboard, and then you and then you can copy and paste it. Check this out. That is dope, ain't it? So it, it copies the the coordinates, and then I can if I'm into the uh, config file, whatever, I can just do. Uh, select it and control V. It's pretty dope. I love that. That's awesome. That's that's an amazing uh, relief tool for if anybody gets into files and things like that. But if you don't know, don't worry about it. So now we bring the the the, the shop as uh, Pekinzi says down to the repair shop. And then what I like to do before I start doing uh, hitting any buttons to activate it, I'm like, hey, how much do I owe you? La 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 la, and go like that, and then go back. And then when I get in the area when I where I press E at, I'll press E. I think the the vicinity is right here. Somewhere around here. Hold on. Let me get around here somewhere. Let me see. Let me see. Come on. Where's my at? There it is. I got to face that way. So then I'll come back and say, okay, sir, can I just get an oil change? That's all I need, sir, is an oil change. Quick oil change. Get in there. And just immersive uh, AI interaction right there that comes. And you just press E. And he'll come and fix your vehicle for you. Quick oil change. It's quick, but there you go. It's done. <laughs> and it fades back out. So that's what I want to show you guys that. So it's pretty cool. Alrighty, so let's go 1041 10 we got our vehicle fixed so that is the immersive mechanic I love that thing and just something different, you know something different so let's go on duty and get it going I know I had you guys waiting for about a couple of a handful of mics, but anyways So we'll go ahead and get the radio popping like we should there we go But we, we're always in here doing something man. like I said anything to make the city better. We're just trying to make it better just it's pretty cool so volume up and then scan there we go alrighty so there we go we're gonna be war 10 8 let's get on the radio and call it in 101 I'll be 1041 10 8 active 71 county wide uh, let's go and it's uh, I've decided to do a uh, you know a mid shift today so let's go it gets, tends to get a little crazy here in the daytime when everybody's up popping walking around and then you know not usually starting in morning you know and I think I feel like that I'm missing something but I don't think I am but I never know and we'll, we'll figure it out oh yeah yes I am forgetting something so dirt level 15 and engine is always on leave extra key bob there you go so I hope you guys like that sorry for the for the brief pause but now they're all over the shop so certain areas you just have to walk around by the vicinity of most shops like that, I put it in the same spot. The ones down, you have to uh, usually walk by toolboxes that where the, where the mechanic usually spawns up. It's going to be in front of the vehicle, but I figured you guys would like that. I thought it was pretty cool. Okay, we're going to go ahead and leave. We're going to leave time froze for a little bit. It's 3 o'clock if you don't know what 1500 hours is. 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Of course, mid shift has to be around that range from 3 to 11 somewhere. So, 
get on in here and that detective call out is, is amazing you can come in here be a detective I answer all the detective call outs no other call outs unless you want you get bored want to interact with something else but that really that that immersive mechanic is something cool and shout out a uh, uh, major 5 PD thank you so much for your time and it's a, definitely a great uh, interaction with the another round of NPCs especially t and if you're a mechanic there's a abandoned vehicle. One one, I'll be responding to that broken down vehicle. Uh, I'll I'll advise one twenty three. So, abandoned. Well, sorry, not abandoned vehicle. Correct, correction. So I, I said broken down vehicle, but abandoned. We won't go code three. We'll just go code one until we get there. Because now, if it's a br uh, broken down vehicle, you know it's usually smoking, or, uh, you know, or something is not right with abandoned. It's usually a pretty code two call out. But I just code one, get up there and. Somebody just left their old car. They can't pay for it no more. They want an insurance claim on it, you know. Her boyfriend took Susie's car because she wouldn't give him a ride to the store. Cause he ain't got no license. Be driving around boat for many years, and she got tired of it. He stole the car, stole the keys, and now he's gonna make her uh, scavenger hunt for a vehicle. <laughs> it is what it is. But man, there. we got the we got the biker gang coming down. There you go, they see me and they're sort of like single file. That's what I'm talking about, fellas. Anyways. But that was that. And the, those biker AIs are not used to... Oh, goodness. No. You're gonna get, you're gonna get attacked? I, I didn't see that. He done it to himself. You don't never ever mess with the murder kitties. You really don't. <laughs> Maybe he's just trying to help his homeboys, but he just don't mess with the murder kitty. And I'm gonna, I'm I'm in route to a call. I'm just gonna say that he just made it run away. Hopefully I don't come. But I'll go the opposite way so I don't have to come back and see him. <laughs> his limbs ripped off by the murder kitty. But yeah, the immersive mechanic is pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Anything that gives a city a more AI interaction, I just love it. Well, I should have came to the coastal seat area. I should have came uh, the other way. Looks like it's going to be probably halfway down on the. Uh, I swear if I knew how to make call outs and if I knew how to do it, oh man, it would be amazing. And I had all the assets and, and stuff to make it happen and I was very good at it. They'd be calling me King Call Out Dave. <laughs> but I can't do that now. I can't do none of that stuff anyways. So. I leave, 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 leave the throne where it needs to be. We're down to a call out. This could be off the roadway. That's good. These windy roads, and you're driving your vehicle that's made some. It just makes the AIs act a little different. Especially with the tiny roads, and then the the gates, the guardrails, and stuff like that. There we go. It's down there. One on one B twenty three. It's more than just slapping cuffs on somebody. It's really about getting out here and doing your thing. And I got some information today. So surprise the crap out of me. Somebody wants to be a Leo again. I was like, oh boy, wait till you guys see. If it happens, it's going to be pretty cool. I don't like going down here because it's going to scratch my unit. Man, I need to find something that moves these gates. It's going to scratch my unit. Somebody left their abandoned vehicle down here around the residence, and you know, these people report everything. And we got a little, looks like a little pig or something down here. See, look, I, lo I love those vanilla events. Little pig eating, eating some grub down here. Hopefully, that thing is friendly. Um.
It's just uh, assuming we got the. Well, what's up, buddy? What are you doing? Just chilling. Hope you don't bite. I'm just down here to remove this abandoned vehicle. Get on out of the way, sir. That's on. Oh, no, I've been I've been eating too much. I can't fit. There we go. One one ten twenty eight. When ready, it's going to be King Robert Lincoln Space Five One Two Three. King Robert Lincoln Space Five One Two Three. It's going to be a Galavaner. It's going to be North Coffee Way 3029, abandoned vehicle. Let's see if this is the caller right here. Hey, buddy, he's drinking on his property, so he could do what he wants. This is his property. If he wants to drink a bud, whatever, a bud, whatever it is, coastal bud, he can do his. How you doing, boss man? Can I have you from uh, attention for a second? I don't want to get too close to him to fight me or something. Lever bald headed. They all look the same. How you doing, boss man? Did you call about this vehicle right here? It ain't yours or nobody uh, around here. All right, we'll have it moved, bud. Yep, it's going to be Sheriff uh, Lugo with the Coastal Bay Sheriff's Office in 101, okay? All uh, right, buddy, as you were, just want to ask you uh, uh, questions about the vehicle. See if you use a caller. All right, thank you, buddy. 101, make contact with the caller. He wants the vehicle removed. Copy traffic. And we're not going to do Coastal Bay tow. We're not going to do 5PD tow. We're going to do DV towing. Smart thing because the little pig... He likes to eat and don't want to have no crazy stuff down here. And poor old guy's enjoying his uh, evening commute. Don't I need to have the old big tow truck down here. So we're going to go ahead and delete that. 101 DB is 23. I'll be clear. I'll uh, be back back tonight. Ah, right, there you go, sir. It's been uh, it's been removed, buddy. Hey, you hear anything else? Just holler at us. I mean, crime related, not other vehicles. Or other vehicles don't matter. We're out here. We're, 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 uh, we, we serve and protect and secure so around those lines it's very broad we do a lot need to put your pig on a leash <laughs> All right, let's go. oh one spot that I don't like to come is this gate put some pinch pinch traps on the Durango so we're just gonna go here and there you go perfect should should have did that anyways Alright, we are back tonight, so we're good. I should have dismissed that pet. Anyways, okay, let's go. Uh, the call's clear, we're good. Going on, I love the paved roads, I really do. I love them. Very well, uh, creator. Same guy that made Chili at Town, man. He made a free resource. I say it again. He's made a free resource for people, and they want to and they want to take it and sell it. So if you guys see this, this uh, Chili Ad Town and any related to Dan Danix Creations, Clawfield Road, Braddock Pass, these are all free. No price tag on them. One one. Can I get a ten twenty and ready ten twenty eight? It's going to be Frank Sam Tom Space five six five eight. Frank Sam Tom Space five six five eight. Coastal Bay ten twenty eight. There it is. It's going to be a Bison, Julian, Cannon. Everything is valid. All clear. That's what we like to see. Law body citizens here in the county. But like I said, the immersive uh, mechanic is pretty cool. That's the last I'll talk about it. Just want to let you guys know it's up and running in there. And just walk around when you try to repair your vehicle. Uh, by the shops like that, especially the vanillas right there by that one spot. The ones we added is I try to put it in the same spot. But keep walking around those areas and press E. And if wherever somebody jumps in the city and don't know the new additions about the other ones. We, it, it has coordinates. No way you can see the coordinates because you're not into the config, but, but the, the the script. But anyways, it'd be pretty cool. We like the ped mastery or any ped interaction. That's AI. We love that. Want to want to be out here at Coastal Sea Main Street? 
Coastal Sea Main Street. It's going to be a discount store. I'll be doing a property check. Show me 10 6. Yeah, y'all. But people joining in earlier, man, sorry for the the brief pause. I shouldn't have done that, but you know, when important stuff... Oh, but hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. As you guys see, I had my audio drive around the thing, you know, testing stuff out. I had my audio. I don't own the rights to that music. That just played a little bit ago, so I don't own the rights to that. How you doing, y'all? Just doing my rounds, just checking on y'all. You guys doing all right? You guys had a good 4th of July? Good, good, good. All right. Well, if you guys need anything, I'm always here. Just want to make, make sure you guys are safe. Have a blessed day. Yeah, I don't have rights to that music that just played. Crazy as hell. <laughs> and the old language of the AI. Yeah. Uh, I figured that's one thing I forgot to do is turn the audio down. But it's down and fixed, so no more. Uh, no more problems. One one I'll be clear. Business check. Code for eight. Now that was a little sway right there. Sorry if I cut in front of you, buddy. Sorry. One on one traffic. In for traffic, it's going to be on a vehicle, black and vehicle SUV. It's going to be Robert Boy Edward. Space 6555, Robert Boy Edward, Space 6555, Coastal 1828. There we go, we got a Landstall Metallic, uh, Jonathan May, no flags, all clear, but he was a little bit of failure to maintain land, so we're going to go ahead and, and light it up. Hopefully, it doesn't run. It's going to ram. That was, if it does that, it's fine, it's my fault. I initiated. So let's go ahead and since it's already here, let's bring it down. Right there. Hopefully it gives me a little bit more space so I can get off the roadway. Add just a little bit more. That should be good enough. One one ten eleven CV Road two zero one seven. We're going to be right here, parallel with the road. We're going to be here out here in the dirt, near the waterfront. Two zero one seven CV Road on that uh, black SUV. Show me ten six status. Happy out with that vehicle. Investigate. All right, let's go make some contact. Yep, see the gates that scratched my unit. I gotta get that fixed. We'll go down to the immersive mechanic, baby, to get it fixed. I didn't do that purposely, I promise I didn't. I don't really like to have marks on my, my unit. I like driving clean, nice, and unmarked. With marks, not, I like driving marked. All right, nervous, suspicious, and nervous. How you doing, sir? Sheriff, look at the Coastal Bay Sheriff's Office. You, everything, uh, you know the reason for the stop? Absolutely, coming down the roadway, uh, CV Road, you, uh, Looks like you're going to turn in, turn out, turn in, uh, failure to maintain lanes a little bit. You got your license, registration, proof of insurance. Can you verify the name on the ID and DOB, please? Jonathan May, 18, 1962. And also, do you have any weapons, license, or anything like that in your possession that I need to be aware of? And weapons license, and he does have a weapons license, so he does have a CCW. So if there's any weapons, he's covered. All right, Mr. May, sit tight. to be back for just a second, okay? did have a license, right?
okay. okay. Oh, the, the identification card is the the weapons license as well, so that's why I gotta watch out for. It. Okay. Uh, he's being a little suspicious and nervous, so we're gonna go ahead and run his name, and then uh, we'll go from there. He's acting a little nervous. So we may just pull him out, check the vehicle, because he's acting suspicious and nervous, I believe, right? Give me the notification of suspicious and nervous. Yep, suspicious and nervous. So he's acting like he's hiding something or something going on that when, uh, especially law enforcement approaches and initiates, so. All right, so his name is, I think what? Was it Jonathan May? Yeah, Jonathan May. Jonathan. Jonathan with an O. There you go, there you go. It's suspicious and nervous, and it says it's expired, but it says it's valid. CCW. It's okay, well, anyway, we're gonna be just focusing on the driver's license. Okay, so it's 2024. Okay, cool. So driver's license is expired. So, uh, Jonathan May, DOB 18-1962, age 62, sex male, 789 Creekside Street, Coastal Seed. No active warrants, just he's just been uh, driving XR 2022. Uh, yeah, it's been a minute, so. Well, 12, 2023, and it's 7, 11, 2024. That's, that's from, that's some months. So. It does say expired, though. That's a long time to be expired. What we'll do, we're going to cut him a break, but first. If he does have a, if he checks out clear nothing in the vehicle, like that we're going to release him with a citation and we drive an unexpired since 2023. Uh, if not, we find something, he's going to go to jail and he's also going to be charged with his driving on a no driver's license expired. Well, so he'll be cited. Okay, anyway, that's what we'll do. Okay. All right, let's get on out here. Of course, put the gloves on because he's going to be searching. He's being suspicious and nervous. I think he may have some stuff on him, anyways. So check him out. Bony, bony, bony. Yes, I got my eyes on. Yes, sir, I do, my bro. When do I not? <laughs> Especially when we're doing this kind of stuff. What's up, boss man? You can hit me with a with a, with a DM if you need me to. Need to. Any, anything urgent, I can always pause it and call you if you need me to. Welcome to the show, my bro. All right, Mr. May. Just if, just at this time, sir. I walked on the view. Uh, walked upon the vehicle. Upon uh, arrival around the area of your uh, passenger side pillar, you act a little bit nervous and suspicious. Okay, so just go ahead and spin around for me. Right now, you're just being detained. Okay, just for my safety. You're not being placed under arrest. And also, you know your uh, license has been expired since 2023. Uh, you've been working a lot and ain't been paying attention to that. Well, you got to pay attention if you're out here on the uh, driving on a uh, vehicle on the roadway. Okay, that's that's the, that's the law. You got to have a valid driver's license to operate a motor vehicle. So come on back here, buddy. Uh, so you just, I, everything was to be uh, kosher. I was going to check you out, probably aside you, but you were well, moving around a lot, nervous, sweating, and you're just acting a little bit, a little, a little weird. So right now I'm going to go ahead and pat you down. So nothing on your, nothing on your person is going to poke me, stick me, harm me anyway. No bombs, grenade, narcotics, any, any schedules that I need to be aware of uh, at this time, on, on your person or in the vehicle. I think he's going to have some stuff on him. I usually tell them on, the, on themselves. Okay, heroin in front pop, and there it is. Hold on, one second, I'll give you something. So you guys know what uh, heroin is? It's Schedule One, so he's gonna be he's gonna be put in jail, and his vehicle's gonna be seized. So, anyways, so it works out best for me. So, cutting the citation, I was weary because cutting the citation from 2023 that long, probably what 
probably more than five months plus that he's driving expired. So it could be in the process of being suspended, revoked. We don't know. He has heroin in his back pocket, so he's going to be placed under arrest. Uh, possession of uh, uh, drug paraphernalia, Schedule 1. Okay. All right, sir, so at this time, sir, everything from, from, from a citation to you're being placed under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say will and can be used against you in a court of law. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be appointed for you. You understand the rights I just read to you. All righty, sir. Yes, you're going to be placed under arrest. You'll get your phone call as soon as you get down to the SO, okay? They're going to dress you out, get all your paperwork done, and ship you down to the Coastal Bay Department of Corrections, okay? So uh, you'll get your phone call then, okay? And your vehicle is going to be seized, all righty? Due to the drug part from the we found. Anything in the vehicle I need to be aware of? That's all you had was on you? Okay, any weapons in the vehicle I need to be aware of? Okay, cool. Thank you. There's no other, no weapons, no no drugs in the vehicle. It's all on him. And he, he's a heroin addict. Trying to get better, we'll pray for him. All right, go ahead, take a seat, boss man. Let me fix your seatbelt real quick. I don't want you to fall out anywhere. And Boney, I got all those uh, immersive, uh, what is it called? Immersive mechanic spots in, but not by the PDs no more. I didn't. I I, tapped, I took out the the whole repair of other stations, the long ones that you guys hated. So I put the immersive ones. I'll show you to do it in just a second, and I'll show you where they're located. Yeah, I'm gonna buckle his safety belt. He's gonna be 10:15 this time, so he's on my time now. He lost his freedom just right now. So right here. So we'll go ahead and look at the map. So boom, we got that. Uh, the vanilla ones was already in there. It's like Costalito. Uh, so the ones we just added, not too much, but we added the repair shop, the one that I that I put in right over there on Route One, and then I put uh, where's the other one I put up, and the uh, one mod shop that we have down at Coastal Shores. This is what it looks like. It's right there, and then all the other ones are right here. I had to add that one. That one wasn't there, but they added that one, and then the other, all the other ones. That was there already so if you go through and you see they are there and that's immersive mechanic and now you have the the pet walk up and do all the stuff then you was right bony the more damage as you've seen before the the longer it takes but it's still quick but you guys should like that because there's no time that i can change where it takes forever like at least like three minutes for the mechanic fixing things <laughs> so uh you guys should be happy about that it's just fix tip go do your thing where you guys have the slash fix key bind in, in, in the in the thing so what we talked about you ready for the journey I'm not gonna say nothing yet but are you ready for the journey oh comms that's gonna be with that's gonna be here to you know I probably let the cat out the bag but a number of calling comms that's gonna be that's gonna be cool though it's gonna be cool I don't know if you're really serious about it or not that's pretty cool though if it is you got me pretty stoked but no pressure. No pressure. Yeah. So when you go in there, the, the vanilla spots, just like the, the mod shops that we went to, it's the common same stuff. I, I mirrored it the same. But just when you go in Benny's, you have to drive all the way in and go to the empty spot and go by the toolbox and press E around the area of that. And then the other one is um, is the, same, the repair shop of mine that I added on Route 1. It's still the same setup as you go and do it. But if anybody has questions... You know, well, I'll be able to tell them. Oh, well, okay. Well, then that sounds even better to me. All right, boss. Man. I, I, everything we talk about that gets you out of your comfort zone. I just want to. I just want to cruise with it. Okay, gotcha. Search the vehicle. All right. There you go. Look at five grams of crystal meth. Crystal meth, there it is. Methane fetting, that's Schedule 2. A loaded 9mm under the seat. But, I don't know. It says that his his weapons license was valid, but it says invalid in the system. So, I'm going to go to the... Uh, let's go back to the unit real quick. Because in the system, it says it's invalid. Go here. Expired weapons license. So, five. So, so he's going to be charged with Schedule... Uh, one, schedule two, and then driving on without a valid driver's license, and then he's got a he's in possession of a legal possession of a firearm, nine millimeter, under the seat. So there you go, and his vehicle is going to get seized because he does have drug paraphernalia, and he has more paraphernalia, crystal meth. So this boy may get five, ten to life. You never know.
I, I, I'm not. I'm not the prosecutor. I'm not the district attorney's office. I'm just a sheriff that comes out here, tries to get it off the roadways, get it off the roads, uh, do these search warrants, all that kind of stuff. We just execute stuff, and what all means, they everything everybody else handles, handles everything else. But like I said, everybody. When you come in here, do your little thing. Don't worry. You are innocent until proven guilty, okay? Awesome. 101, 1051 in my location, 2017 Seabrook Road on this vehicle. It's going to be a seized vehicle. Copy drop. All right. So there we go, dispatch, and we're going to go ahead and get the big tow down here. Uh, I always hit the, hit the wrong key. 10 4 copy drop, ETA 2 my south. Sorry, I hit my Windows key and not my... Uh, uh, talk key. My talk key's right next to my window key, so. 101 is 23. Uh, here, here momentarily, I'll be clear back tonight. Also, I'll be 1015. Well, correction, could we get a 1014 prison transport to my location? It's going to be 1020 CV Road. 10 4, just advise them that the traffic. Uh, 101 County. Be advised, we have this mail. First name is going to be uh, repair to copy. Just advise when you're prepared to copy. First name, last name, DOB. 10 4. First name is going to be John, Oscar, Henry, Nora, Adam, Tom, Henry, Otter, Oscar, Nora. Repeating John, Oscar, Henry, Nora, Adam, Tom, Henry, Oscar, Nora. Last name is going to be Mike, Adam, Yankee. Mike, Adam, Yankee. DOB is going to be 8 10 1962. Last name, Mike, Adam, Yankee. DOB is going to be 8 10 10 1962 copy traffic uh one sees 23 thoroughly search him 1084 uh traffic uh different types just ship search him thoroughly copy traffic all right let's go 10 4 central uh 10 14 two mics out copy traffic all right let's get us some prison transport down here for this this, this dude and of course we're going to store this in the unit and then we're gonna go ahead and we'll we'll put the drug and stuff. We'll give it to Jeremiah and just then we'll wait for prison, prison transport to come twenty three, and then we will go ten tonight. There we go. One on one fourteen is gonna be twenty three. I wish you guys would park a little bit better, you know, because you know you're gonna you guys are gonna get really hurt one of these days. If it wasn't for me looking out for y'all, you guys would miss Betty Lou in there would be uh, slung into the ravine over there by uh, traffic and a. Uh, I love that the tra AIs don't stop for the uh, traffic. It shows police can do anything they want. <laughs> they have the key to the city. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. We'll, just, we'll save that evidence. We'll have it in the vehicle. 101-1423, as advised, I'm going to be clear. Back 10 ain't available. There you go, fast traffic, 1014 picks up Jonathan May, the mechanic, immerse mechanic is quick and easy, come in, do your thing, get it fixed, get it go, just depends on how much damage your vehicle has, too bad it don't have a time limit because I would have at least across the board at least a minute to see the mechanic fix the vehicle, but everybody's jumping for joy because they like to get in there and get out, I like to stay in there a little bit for a while and, and get used to uh, the, the asset and the, the, the script, you know. But we got drugs and guns off the street, and we're back on. We're back today. 11228 is going to be Paul 9 Sam, Space 8 Edwards 8. Paul 9 Sam, Space 8 Edward 8, Coastal 8 to 28. We're just running traffic. I mean, I know they're, they're, they didn't do anything, but I'm just running traffic. Usually we start out with the businesses and stuff like that. We start out this today with the call outs, and we get in there and do our thing. So we have a Habanero P9S. Space 8, Edward 8, Fra uh, Forrest Kelly, all valid, all clear. That's what we like to see. That's what we like to see. Let's go ahead and continue time now. And let's see. There you go, brother. Because some of y'all like to see the nighttime. I can't wait till the new uh, version of NV comes out. Some cool stuff coming with the thing. I don't know if the clouds are going to be fixed. I don't think... Uh, they came up with an update to fix the, the, the clouds, so that's why we don't have the clouds. I miss them. But you got to work with what you got when you don't have no control over it. So, But NVE, without the clouds, Raz, he still does a great job. He, If something's missing, he tries. He goes over and beyond and tries to to make something cover if something's not, not fixable yet. It's fixable, but 
it's all like a uh, uh, oh no what was I going to say like a fence link or like a I can't even remember what I was going to say like a chain link you know it all one affects one and really you can't get it smoothed out until everybody's on the same page so It's a 60 zone, man. You, you got to go a little bit faster and you're going to get in a, a lit up for impeding. Come on, go a little bit faster. You're going 23. That truck's going slow, too. Goodness. At least go with the flow of traffic. Okay. That could be somebody coming around and them going that slow, especially around curves and stuff. A car come around and smack them because they're going 30 miles under the speed limit and the car's going exactly where it needs to be going. Not good. I just want to, I just want to educate them. Code Ida. Legal or, or education purposes advised to the driver. Coastal Bay State Roleplay, whoever put that is awesome, is the best. I did not put that. Whoever put that, I love you. Thank you so much for thinking that Coastal Bay is, is a place to play. It really is. We, we're looking for quality over quantity. So if you come in here and you've joined the city and you didn't re or meet the requirements, the rules, and we treat it like real life, just like, the, 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 just like real life is, if we don't get in contact with you, and sorry, life is uh, life is real. We have real life things to do. Life is priority here. And if we get to you, you're enticed to join the city, like to role play. You'll stick around and be patient, because you know when when we have to take time out of our uh, days and, and get it going, get everything situated. We don't mind to, but it's just we're looking for quality over quantity. So just be advised. If you join the city and nobody reaches out to, we always say hello. We always say hey, what's going on? The staff team always reaches out to people, but. You know, it's just if you want to be in here, you'll be in here, uh, uh, being patient and waiting to be called on and stuff like that. But we do, we do work, we do our due diligence. It's summertime, as school's out, people's doing things. So just be advised by that. Whoever sees this stream, like now that we're ignoring you, we'll get to you. It's just we're busy as well. We could work, do we we got jobs, we're dads, uh, you know, all that kind of stuff. So just be advised. If you see the content, and just imagine if you be patient and see the authentic realistic role play be patient when we get you uh get to you if we like what we hear to see and we like what we hear from you then uh, you'll be part of a, a great thing i'm not saying we're the best we're just we're just some role players looking for authentic role play that's legit and, and realistic if i advise that already one one uh, 10 11 traffic it's going to be east joshua road on that 1028 earlier p9s space 8 edward 8 Paul 9, uh, Sam, Space 8, Edward 8, Coastal Bay 10, 28, uh, copy trap, I don't even know if I read the plate or not. Yeah, it's Forrest Kelly, everything's valid, Humber there, okay, that's good. I'll be out with that vehicle, 3010 East Joshua Road, show me 10-6. Alright, let's get on out here and make some contact. Okay, so let's go and we'll do the Y thing, and let's put the gloves up because nobody's going to jail. And then sooner we'll take our glass off. We did we did hit Y, so they may act a little different. I like to get in first person and walk up because you just never know what you can There's occupied times two. You just never know how they can act. Go. With the with the with the Y. You get a surprise sometimes. How you doing, gentlemen? Sheriff Lugo at the Coastal Bay Sheriff's Office. Driver, you know the reason for the stop? Absolutely. Do you know the postal speed limit on this roadway, this road, this stretch of road is? Until you get to the residential uh Past the sheriff's office, uh, in the middle of it, it goes to 45, okay? It's a 60 posted speed limit, okay? I was behind you, you was going 23. The reason for the uh, initiation and and uh, traffic stop is because you're going way below the posted speed limit. If somebody comes around the curve going 70 or 60, 65 miles per hour, and you're going 20, you know, I'm just looking out for your safety and everybody else's, you know? The the, the people that's going with the flow of traffic and and when you're repeating traffic so that's the reason for the stop so you got your license registration proof of insurance driver okay okay Forrest Kelly can you state the DOB please 
Eleven thirty two thousand one. Okay. Do you have any weapons license or anything that need to be aware of anything in the vehicle? No more. All right. Uh, well, Mr. Uh, Kelly, sit tight. Be back in just a second. Okay. Forrest Kelly. Check. Let's let's a check of the system. No, not that. No, wrong. Yeah, that's what we need. I need to change my e bind to F10 or F9 for the MBT and F10 for the for the Sonoran. That's I think. And my, every time we have an update, my dang logo gets messed up. I gotta fix that again. Never a dumb moment when you dab and stuff like that. Something's always you have to fix something. Gotta love the updates. Gotta love them. And as you guys see, Forrest Kelly, driver's license expired uh, since 2021. Oh, boy, here we go. Uh, Forrest Kelly, DOB 429, uh, 1989, age 35, sex male. Address going to be 548 Franklin Street, Coastal Seed. Uh, driver's license expired since 2021. No reason priors. All right. Well, we're going to order everybody, everybody out of the vehicle. And we'll go from there. It's time to put the gloves on. Let's quit freeze time right there. It got a little, it got a little dark a little bit. Put slow traffic down just a little bit. Let's start slowing down about right here. There we go. All right, Mr. Kelly, can you step out of the vehicle? Everybody step out of the vehicle and let me see your hands, okay? Just, just, uh, you, I'll tell you exactly what's going on. Everybody step out of the vehicle and, and please keep, stay where I can see your hands, okay? Mr. Kelly, at this time, right, sir, you're just being detained, okay? You've been operating a motor vehicle and your, uh, your uh, DL's expired, okay? All right. Come on back here. All right, buddy. All right, passenger, stay right there, okay? Don't go nowhere. Fucked up. All right. Right now, you do. Uh, you can just follow me over here, okay? I have to stop him, I believe. Oh. Fuck that shit. Sorry, buddy. I need to get a little bit close to you. I don't mean to be invade your personal space. All right, come on. Uh, follow me over here. Right, right in the back of the unit, okay? No, no, never, bad, 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 sorry, 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 sorry. Come right here. Right here, stand right here by this uh, left quarter panel. Right there, come on over here. Right there, stop right there. Perfect, stay right there, don't move, okay? No, no reason, no, no need to, 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 to detain you. Just, just stay where I can see you. Okay. Pull him back here for a second. Pull them away from each other. So he have to take cover if he wants to. So he thinks like he's pretty pretty compliant. Okay, Mr. Kelly, uh, just be advised, you've been, uh, your DL says it's been expired since 2022, correct? Yeah, you're out here operating a motor vehicle without a driver's license. Do you have anything in your pocket supposed to poke me, stick me, harm me in any way? No bombs, grenade, narcotics? On your person or in the, in, the, in the vehicle I need to be aware of? Sorry, guys, I got tongue tied. Yeah, the reason for the stop is you're uh, you're impeding traffic. So if it was going, if it wasn't for that, you'd go into flow of traffic. You'd be on to the next destination where, wherever you guys were going. So at this time, sir, I'm going to go ahead and pat you down. Nothing in your pocket, probably stick your arm, no bombs, grenade, narcotics on your person in the vehicle. Need to be aware of. All right, cool. That's that's cool with me. Just go ahead and uh, we're going to go ahead and put you in there right now. Okay, you're going to be uh, going to jail for operating a motor vehicle without a driver's license. Okay. Go take a seat. Nothing to be a car need to be aware of, right? I will endure my own face. Alright. Alright, buddy, what's your name, man? Can I get your ID from you? Can I get your ID? I didn't mean to cuff him. Press X. Sorry, bud. Sorry, I didn't mean to I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to detain you. Hold on. Let me undetain you. Oh, 
say nothing to keep it cool. Everybody makes mistakes, and I did. Ah, uh, buddy, can you come right here, bud? Uh, just stand in front of my unit. And, okay, I gotta search this vehicle. Okay. Oh, there we go. He's gonna fall down now. Okay. So, uh, wh what's your name, man? Okay, Francisco Ingram. Okay, Mr. Ingram, I'll be back with a second, okay? Francisco. Okay, let's go to... There we go. Nothing of interest, just a uh, expired fishing license. No issue priors. Okay, cool. Perfect. Hi, right, Mr. Ingram. Here's your ID back, buddy. Just sit, sit tight for me right there. Okay, don't go nowhere, all right? Be back for a second. Hey, Mr. Kelly, be advised, man. Uh, do you want to release your vehicle uh, with this individual? I haven't even, I don't even know yet. I haven't even searched yet. But I, if, if everything checks out, you said there's nothing in the vehicle and it's all clean, I'm, I'm, I'm down to let him take your vehicle. Are you good with that if I don't find anything? Anything in the vehicle I need to be aware of? If everything checks out, if you want to, I'll lay your keys right there. You want to let him drive it off and take it home? I won't tow it. Okay. Make sure that there's nothing in the vehicle. Cause that can change everything. All right, your accuser are right there, and uh, we'll do our thing. Appreciate your cooperation. There you go. All right, Mr. Ingram, can you come over here for a second, buddy? Follow me over here. Come on, right over here, buddy. Right there. Oh, you about to get dealt with right now. Let's, let's not let's not go to jail for disorderly conduct, okay? I just, no, come over here. That ain't good. Right here, stop right here. I canceled you. I don't know why you're not listening to me. Okay, right there, perfect. Oh, all right, stay right there, buddy. All right, so he went there. I'm gonna go ahead and search the vehicle. I'm gonna open the front door and then the side door, because I didn't get no indicators of any narcotics or anything like that, so. Just because he had an expired deal doesn't mean everybody's a criminal. I won't really search it like it's like has dope in it. We'll search it and see what's popping. Here, one above me, how about that? Let's get here once if there's an occupied times two, so let's get air one above us. Alrighty, yeah, air one likes to come check on since it's occupied times two. I'm only one working a day, so I want to keep it safe and sorry. How about that? Ten grams of wean under the seat, so we'll say driver's seat loaded, uh, 38 revolver in the trunk, loaded pistol under seat. So under seat, so there we go. And in ten grams of weed. boss and I found another weapon under the seat do you have a weapons license by chance I think you do don't you I believe he has a weapon I believe okay he does so and is all the, um, all those weapon yours or where was you guys headed to anyways you guys gonna go shooting in the county okay cool okay that's cool that's, that's totally understandable you gotta you got your you got a concealed weapon so you got your permit so there you go but Okay, perfect. And the 10 grams of weed is going to be confiscated and then uh, destroyed, okay? So, uh... He said you're able to drive the vehicle. You want to drive the vehicle off and head and take it take it to his house or take it to yours, wherever. He's going to be booked for uh, operating a motor vehicle without a driver's license. Alrighty. Alrighty. Let's see if we can follow up. 
Okay, follow me over here and you'll be good to go. Okay, he can take he has a permit. Of course not. He's not, that shit ain't real. he's not in the vehicle. So I'm gonna have to probably just delete it. Okay, we'll just say that he took anyways. I was hoping that sometimes you get lucky and then they get in the vehicle and take it. We'll say that he took it down the road. Alright. Air one I'm code for. Appreciate you, thank you. One one, can I get a ten fourteen prison transport to my location? It's gonna be East Joshua Road three zero one zero for this uh, whiskey, Mike. Jonathan May, I think, right? No force, Kelly. Jonathan May was the last one. Ten four, copy traffic. Just advise when they're twenty three. Or I'll advise when they're twenty three. Coming behind us. There we go. One on one fourteen to twenty three. Thank you, boss man. He's gonna be the one uh driving on an expired, okay? And his uh his his uh other subject took the vehicle home. Alright, Mr. Kelly, take care of yourself. I don't know where you're going, but Hopefully you spawn in the vehicle. Yeah, he's probably going to anyways. There we go, there he goes. One one I'll be clear off my traffic stop. Ten fourteen twenty three in route with Mr. Kelly to the ESO for processing. I'm available. I seriously didn't put coastal base in this. I really didn't. I'm just letting y'all know somebody else did. And that's very, very heart heartwarming on a serious note. It's pretty cool. They could put anything they wanted on that board. And they said coastal base the best. That's awesome. That was a quick transport. Goodness, that was quick as crap. We love to see the exports coming to the bay, baby. Bring that supplies we need it.
Got to put code four. Called it, but I didn't uh, cancel the call out. Yeah, Parents are still on vacation, so stop by, check out. We're right by. Guys, I brought back home. I'm going to Man, phone is blowing up today, y'all. We back at it. Don't worry, Daddy's still here. jail for a minute so I'm gonna go ahead and put his card over here you can only do what you can do man it still breaks my heart but touch his card I'll automatically start itching huh. that's just the uh, animation that plays with the card I still think the world of the old guy. I just wish he'd stay out of trouble. But he, he has some drugs on him and stuff. And this is not his first conviction from the past. So, never 
know how it could turn out to be. What can you say? I'll be out here at Larry's RV sales. Show me 10 6. Haven't been in here in a minute to check on these guys, man. I haven't said hi, hello in a minute. How you doing, guys? You guys doing all right? Just checking on you guys. Everything going good? Yeah, don't worry, Charles. He's. Uh, he got arrested the other day, so he won't be around for a minute. Um, so, yeah, he's, 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 in, he's in, the, in the prison over there. Yeah, I see the parking lot's a little dirty. I see you guys have got security. I, probably, I assume that security keeps it run off the majority of the time. So maybe that's why he went down to the city because the security guard. But you got to do your job, you know. I right, well, just want to stop by. Tell Rick I said hello, okay, buddy? You guys take care. Be safe. How do you need anything? RV shop. Larry's gonna be code four. I'll be back at you. Uh, we said eight, but we're gonna do a little quick car wash real quick. A little car wash real quick, y'all. Little car wash. Oh. Yeah, Charles got arrested not too long ago, so he that's why he's not around. Even the guys from the, the shop. Man, we're yeah, well he got arrested. So hate to arrest the dude, but you gotta do what you gotta do. There we go. Let's clean it up, make it look nice at nighttime. We don't like to ride dirty, only when we're doing the job. When we're out here and the radio's not popping as much and not really priority calls, we like to be clean a little bit, be presentable. And I forgot to say today, behind the vehicle, you got to trust. If you drive sober, get pulled over. <laughs> there you go, she's all cleaned up. The whip is cleaned up. And we got an oil change, as you guys seen, the Immerse uh, mechanic. We got an oil change, so we're golden for a minute. Just don't want to run over the security guard and his pooch. Oh, there we go, nighttime. Let's, let's pause it on nighttime for a little while. Let's lock it at 2341. There we go. Come over by the businesses and check. I'd like to check over here as well. Check the old businesses, make sure nobody's breaking and entering or anything like that. B&E's or anything like that. Never really too many calls on this side because Coastal County is just right, right, right down the street. So, and 141, he keeps his deputies in, in especially areas that's like next to the prison. Keep these patrolled pretty regularly. So that's good. And we can get out here and mostly down this way, we do the same thing. So, you know, it is what it is. We just cleaned the car and came down the first dirt road we seen. <laughs> but that's dirt road deputy in it. Oh, I don't know. I don't know why I hit the report. I don't want that one. So, didn't mean to hit that, didn't mean to hit that button. Pretty much got all my hotkeys uh, straightened out, and then whenever I run Civ, I'm gonna number lock my pad when I'm st streaming, so I can do the object spawner and haul some stuff and do do some different stuff with the object spawner. So it's pretty cool. I got hold on one second. I got a 21 again. Stand by.
Oh, sorry, guys, we're back. <clears throat> sorry about that. Take that off the thing. I forgot what I was saying, so anybody in the chat, if you can... I don't know what I was saying, but it's all good. We're uh, continuing patrol. Night, we're nighttime in it a little bit, I guess. We're going to run some traffic still a little bit as well. Run some traffic, see what's popping. 101, could get to 28, ready to 28. 1020's going to be Mike 4 Zebra, space 3, Henry 3. Mike 4 Zebra, space 3, Henry 3. You're not doing that. I'm just, just reading some plates, that's all. I don't want to have no. Got to go slow in the dirt, I understand. So we have a Stranum. Mike, four zebra, space three hundred three, jewel, childs. Everything's valid, all clear, so we good. That's in the city, Wispy Mountain Drive. I know that this is this car gonna stop at that stop sign. They don't ever, never stop at anything like that. I'm just gonna initiate in this car because I'm like, did you see that stop sign that you just rode through? It did stop that intersection, but we're gonna light it up anyways. Try not to hit no signs today, how about that? There we go. A good spot right there, no matter if it's in the grass. We're in the grass anyway, so we are golden. So I can pull up on it a little bit. There we go. One one traffic. It's gonna be Panorama Drive, right across from the airfield, right here in the dirt. Three zero three eight. Ten twenty eight advise earlier. Mike four zebra, space three hundred three. I'll be out with that vehicle. Show me ten six status. Times two. Sir, get back in your vehicle. Why are you doing what you're with your hands up? Get back in the vehicle. Go on, get back in the vehicle. You're all right. Get back in the vehicle. Are you hiding something or something? You may have treach. You never know. Don't want to step in between the vehicle. Can't do what I was going to do. How you doing, sir? What are you doing step on a vehicle on a traffic stop? If you ain't done nothing, you don't have to get out with your hands up. You have any medical issues or anything like that that will cause you just to get out and put your hands up in the air? Oh, you're not from here? Well, around here you don't have to... And you've never been on a traffic stop before? Okay, well you don't have to get out and put your hands up, okay? Stay in the vehicle at all times. That stuff will get you hurt, okay? You got your license, registration, proof, insurance, driver? Mr. Jewel Childs, okay, 1229-1977. Okay, all right, buddy, sit tight, be back in just a second, okay? Just stay, when, you, when you're in a traffic stop, stay in your vehicle until you're approached, okay? Boy, some people. That stuff would get you taste or that get you shot. Jumping out like that, Jewel Childs. He said he's never been out, I'm not gonna say that he's never, he's from a different country, sorry. You have to really not not be from in this area in the in the U.S. or anything like that. If you never on a traffic stop, to get out and put your hands up, unless you're guilty of some sort. But we're gonna run his name. Go ahead. It's gonna be Jewel. All right.
name's not coming back. Finally. Oh, well, he lives in Costalito. Jewel Childs, 1220-1976, ages 48, sex male, 660, Alta Road, Costalito Bay. Costalito. No active warrants. Valid driver license in 2028. He does have a little nowhere about the finish line. And no recent priors, so we're going to go ahead and cut him a warning today. Him that nervous. So about that, so. I didn't get no indicator that he was suspicious or nervous or anything like that, I don't think. And a code zero. I knew it. Whenever they, it takes a minute to do that. All right, well, guys, we're going to end it there. Uh, we had a crash, so I appreciate everybody stopping by, showing some love. Thank you so much, Boney. Thank you so much, Kenzie. Everybody that jumped in. Sorry for uh, stopping so short, but um, anyways, we got to start prepping for work and all that kind of stuff. So everybody have a blessed day, blessed night. God bless you guys. Much love from the David L. Gaming family. Until next time, thank you so much. David L.